So you dragged me over here. I have no idea what the story is. And we've spoken about the Anderson sway hitch thing before because it's another one I can't necessarily screw up. Some of the others are a little more complicated. So what are we talking about, JC? You betcha. What we're talking about is a hitch that's going to look after not just your front to back weight distribution, but the bigger issue we see today is sway, the back end of the trailer swaying along as you go down the road. Because your traditional weight distribution hitches that you have with the steel bars, all they're doing is they're putting weight on the front and on the trailer. They're taking the weight off the back of the truck. That's all they're designed to do. But when we do that, there is movement on the back of the trailer. That back end is just gonna kick everywhere. So that's what's called a sway control. And a lot of people get them confused. I know in the old days, they say, don't pack the stuff in the back of the trailer because that puts too much weight in and, and you're guaranteed to get sway. You but I know also when you've got strong wind coming away, then the trailer is more inclined to sway because of the wind, wind resistance as well. You so solution, come on. And that's back in the day is, is we used to have the axles further back. But now with bigger trailers, heavier trailers, the axles have moved ahead and that's why we get all the sway. So sway, there's always a solution, we can fix it. Um, but there are two different types of sway. There's active sway control and passive sway control. Now passive sway control is, uh, you know, you've seen those bars with the brake pads that you can put in between the truck and the trailer, it's just a rod in between. Uh, that's a passive, so that's stopping the trailer from moving. That's, uh, it's already moving, it's just slowing it down. That's passive. Active sway control is a sway control that's always trying to pull the trailer straight. So instead of stopping the movement, it's always trying to set it back to back to straight. But this little red thing, that's the dampener we're talking about? You bet. This is a as dampener here. That? <laughs> that's just a little two-inch dampener. That's all it is. So I need to get an Anderson hitch. Is that is that the, the, it's the way I personally went? It's actually the way that most of our Salesmen will suggest to you when you purchase a new RV just because it is one hitch that you can use on any trailer So you're only buying one hitch in your towing career Big job to get them on? No, super straightforward. Come see us. We'll walk you through. Lots of people even set them up just at home